My Cool Inventions, where you vote to make or break an inventor's dream. With your host, ACOS the Solutionist. Now, here's ACOS. Well, good day. You're tuned into the My Cool Inventions Network. I'm Akos, the solutionist, your host, co-hosting today, Andrew Jankura, jazz musician extraordinaire. And by the way, you don't brag about yourself enough, but uh, let me tell you, one of the best jazz keyboard players on the face of the earth happens to be my baby brother also. And by the way, <laughs> this guy here and me, we've spent over 10,000 hours at trade shows pitching inventions, pitching products. We yeah. know a thing or two about products, and we have an eye or, th- eye or two about what's a good product and what's not a good product. This is the show where you come on to the program, inventors come and they pitch their products to you guys. You guys vote. Thumbs up, thumbs down. You decide who has the next $100 million idea. It's all up to you. And in fact, the last show we were on live with, we had what a great product. Remember that five-in-one grill thing? Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Emiliano Mad. I mean, this, this looks like a grill, not a grill. Well, it is a grill, but it's yeah. a grill. He cranks a crank, and the grill becomes a flat top, <laughs> just like that. Now it's doing breakfast. Now it's doing eggs. Now it's doing bacon. Cranks the grill again. Now it's a smoker. Cranks the grill again. Now it's 800 degrees. Fahrenheit pizza cooker. That's the best doggone grill I've ever seen in the history of grills. And he brought it right here on My Cool Inventions. You guys saw it first. Let me tell you, his pitch was outstanding. I was on the phone with him yesterday. Great pitch. I want you to listen to his pitch, and then I'm going to reveal how you guys voted. Al, let's listen to his pitch. Do you have any ideas? I have a great idea. Pitch it to me. Pitch it, pitch it to me. Hey, I got an idea. Well, let's hear it. different tradition and cooking methods from all around the world. After 20 years in designing and developing equipment for the food industry and have the privilege to travel around the world and enjoy different culture and tradition, I would like to present you with the number one grill. This grill is changing the idea of outdoor cooking. In a matter of seconds, you'll be able to switch from one application to another one. Starting from the North American tradition with the slow cooking, smoking, and grilling by using charcoal and wood. With a single rotation, you'll be able to experience the Central and South America, all the way to Asia and India, on the favorite method of cooking on the flat top. With auto rotation, we combine tradition between grilling and flat top. And for life, speed and performance on your favorite guys' grilling. Make or break an inventor. Be our shark and vote. Be bold and submit your product. What the heck? You can only make millions. Well, what do you think, Andrew? Was that the best grill you've ever laid eyes on? Absolutely killer. <laughs> and by the way, he's one of the best cooks that I've ever met either. When he says killer, it's killer. You know what that means? It's great. Yeah. Uh, by the way, uh, we all voted thumbs up. In fact, I think I placed an order for one. <laughs> I was on the, you guys voted 86% thumbs up. Emiliano's Grill. Oh, my goodness gracious. That is one heck of a grill. I can taste everything cooking on it already. Oh, yeah. <coughs> I can hardly wait to get one. Now, he's got a little uh, crowdfunding thing going on and he's got he's got it on a special price there yeah. my goodness uh, you guys 86 percent thumbs up so that's pretty good that's a very good thumbs up grill and and i think it's uh one of the best inventions we've had you know why we like food and that's got fire <laughs> in food and i'm a man that's just the best combination ever man give me a cold food. refreshment and i'm in <laughs> that's right absolutely uh my my brother he kid we did guyash uh, which is a hungarian uh, kind of a stew uh we cooked it on the weekend, but we didn't cook it uh, inside like, you know, you know, like regular people. We made a fire <laughs> outside. We put it on a cauldron. We baked it outside for hours. Yeah. It was delicious. We'll talk food more. Now, let me tell you about what's coming up tomorrow. Tomorrow is very important. If you're an inventor, you're a product owner, you're a product developer, I want you to tune into Inventor Masterclass. Let me tell you something. Inventor Masterclass, this is where we teach you things that you don't learn on the street. This is, I'm not on the school. This is where you learn it from 30 years experience. And I'm going to teach you something called get selling. You know, because inventors, Andrew, want to get selling. They want to sell their products. They want to get funding. They want to sell the the, the inventions to people who might buy it or people who might fund it or people who, customers who might take it home. So it's all about selling, right? So I'm going to reveal the biggest secret when it comes to selling inventions tomorrow at 2 o'clock Wednesday. Now, here's what you need to do. We only have 200 seats.
seats. And last week, this Invention Masterclass sold out. We couldn't put anybody else more on. I have a limited amount of seats. We only let 200 people listen. Why? Because I answer questions and I want to get to everybody. And actually, we might adjust that size down a little bit because because so many people had so many questions that uh, yeah. I want to be fair to everybody. So, um, so Inventors Masterclass tomorrow at 2 p.m., but you have to register, okay? Tony's going to put the link in there right now for your registration. So register for Inventors Masterclass. Reserve your seat. It's absolutely free. It does not cost anything. The only thing you have to pay is a little attention. That's all you have to pay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> because if you pay a little attention, you'll sell some more. I promise you that. Over 30 years experience, we're going to invent. And it's a fantastic uh, a secret. And nobody, everybody overlooks it. And it's one of the best ways to get things moving. We had so many positive testimonials uh, from last week. Uh, so we extended this week. Ext get selling Inventor Masterclass tomorrow, 2 p.m. live. But you have to register. Hit the registration there. Uh, if you're watching Facebook, it's pinned to the top there. Just Click on it, register your place, and make sure you attend. All I can tell you, you probably will make a lot more money. Now, let's go on today's inventor. Now, today's inventor, it's a pretty cool thing because, you know, it's hot, it's sweaty, you're playing baseball, you're doing all kinds of things outdoors, and if you're in Florida, you're melting on there. <laughs> so this inventor is really cool. Colin Icarella. I I Colin Icarella. Uh, he's presenting uh, Justin Johnson's invention. It's called No Sweats. This is really cool. When I first came in here, Al showed it to me. What you do is you put put this on the inside of your ball cap or inside of your hockey uh, helmet or inside of your baseball helmet and it collects and, and prevents all stuff. So we have uh, Colin. Colin, welcome to the program. Hey guys, uh, thank you for uh, having me on today. Uh, excited to kind of share the invention where we're at. Hey listen, uh, tell everybody what is No Sweat. Yeah, so No Sweat is a patented disposable sweat liner. Uh, we make sweat liners for hats, helmets, hard hats, and visors. Uh, product started as a a hockey company basically we're out of minneapolis minnesota uh land of ten thousand lakes uh half the year they're frozen um but uh yeah so you know minnesota-based product uh started with referees because referees didn't have a uh, solution to getting sweat from pouring down their face into their eyes or fogging up their shield uh -huh. um so the, the inventor's dad uh, at a table actually during college when they, they had to come up with an idea for uh, business school and uh, they came across this. No one had patented sweat technology for head helmets, uh, hats, headwear in general. And uh, so they patented and then uh, kind of sat on the idea until after college. And then, um, yeah, after uh, they graduated, uh, the two brothers, kind of Justin and JT, took the, the product to market and uh, ups and downs of every company. Um, and uh, I joined about a little over two years ago full time. Um, and I'm the head of sales. So yeah, the company's been uh, growing uh, pretty rapidly here in the last, I'd say, 16 months. It's been kind of where we've been really seeing great traction in the markets. And um, yeah, it's, it's been an exciting ride so far. All right. So hold on for a second. I heard all about the company. What the? Pro how does? Like, so I got it in my hand here, Andrew. See this thing? Yeah. It looks like a pad of some sort. It looks like it fits inside your baseball cap there. Yeah. So how does? What's going yep. on here? Well, how does it work here? Uh, how does so, yeah, it I'll show you a little live demo. We call this our uh, sham wow or sweat wow demo. But when you sweat now, that moisture and sweat that would go down your face or into your favorite ball cap, it actually gets instantly converted into the product, uh, pulled into the product, I'm sorry, and converted to a gel. So, so, the, so, so slow down. So, hold, on, hold, on, hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Give, so a little sales pitch advice. Just get a little pause because you just performed a miracle. I've got my mouth open <laughs> wondering what just happened. Yeah. I need to look at it a little longer. So you get so the, this pad here, the water gets into it, it sucks into it, and then the water immediately turns to a gel? Correct, yep. So the, the product has uh, what we call sweat lock technology. And, sweat uh, lock absorb. technology. <laughs> I love yep. it. Sweat lock. <laughs> and it can absorb up to 11 times its weight sweat lock. in sweat and moisture. Um, also good with youth players. Uh, it's an FDA hypoallergenic top sheet. So it's really good with skin contact, uh, any irritation or you know acne you might get to helps clear that up. All right, gang, everybody watching right now, we're on the Facebook stream, you're on the YouTube stream. If you're watching, throw your comments up there. I want to see Steve Warple's already give me a thumbs up there. What do you guys think of this thing? Sweat lock technology. Slap it in your hat, slap it in your cap. Next thing you know, you don't have sweat pouring down your face. There's a problem solved for you. Pretty, pretty cool. So uh, how much, I'll, I'll wait for the pitch to ask you how much it is. So you've got it for baseball caps, obviously hockey helmets. Uh, where else would I use it? Maybe if I'm, uh, like, 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 give me, oh, golf, golfing hats. Uh, 
uh, what else? Like, where else would I use this uh, sweat lock technology? Yeah, definitely. So the hat uh, liners, you know, kind of growing across multiple markets. Obviously, a lot of sports, a lot of activities you're wearing hats. So, um, you know, we have chefs wearing in the kitchen to, you know, stop sweat from coming down into the food prep area. Um, from landscapers that get, you know, one hat a summer and they want to kind of maintain the look of that hat with the company logo on it. So I know they can use it. And then obviously your obvious markets, um, you know, baseball, uh, golf, um, you know, some of the sporting markets, tennis, where you wear hats. Um, Construction. And, you know, it's really, really growing. Kind of the proof in the pudding. Uh, if you look on Amazon, some of the, you know, re- reviews, I think our hat product, uh, it has over 300 reviews on it, averaging like 4.2 stars. So it's... Um, all right. just, you know, you buy a forty dollar hat at your favorite event, and uh, you come home and you sweat and do it, and uh, you might get sweat stains and start smelling bad. And this will just help that hat last a little longer. All right, so so there you got it. There's a sweat lock technology. Now we're going to take a little break. After the break, we're going to ask Colin to give us his best sixty second pitch. Now how that works? He's going to come on. He's only going to get sixty seconds. He's not going to get sixty one. He's not going to get fifty nine. We're going to put the hammer down on him right at sixty. So if he's got things to say, you're not going to hear it. And if he goes too short, there's going to be an awkward ticking sound. So let's see how close he can get his best pitch in sixty seconds. And you guys get ready to vote. You guys are going to vote thumbs up, thumbs down. You decide if this is a hundred million dollar product or not. Not me. Now listen, if you're an inventor, you want to be on Inventor Showdown. And how do you get on Inventor Showdown? You get on this show. So this show, you get a big thumbs up. You might end up on that reality show, Inventor Showdown, season two, coming up the first Sunday of August. Yes, and we got looking for a couple more inventors. We're a couple inventors short right now. So we're looking for the very best of candidates. So go submit. Submit your invention right now to mycoolinventions.com. Mycoolinventions.com. You submit, get on the show. Do you have the next $100 million idea? You'll never know till you submit. We're always throwing those used dead batteries away. That can get pricey. And battery rechargers are big and bulky. How do we get around this problem? Hi, I'll make off the solutions to tell you that most people have a USB port and we have USB rechargeable batteries. That's right. Plug the USB AA batteries into any USB port and recharge them even lets you know with an LED indicator the status of the charge and there's a present voltage control circuit to prevent overcharging. The USB batteries can be charged up to 500 times. Now that's a lot of charges. Get these incredible USB rechargeable batteries and have charged batteries whenever you need them. Normally the USB battery sells for $39.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget, the USB batteries are only $15.99, and you buy one, get one free, get two batteries. Click on MyCoolGadgets.com or call 1-888-877-0490, one 888 order now. You have beautiful potted flowers, and they're all on the patio ground where you really can't see them. And you have that fence that is plain and empty. Hi, I make us the solutionist with the perfect solution, the Flower Pot Perfect Hook. These hooks were created to bring your potted plants up off the ground to eye level where they're in plain view. And they'll make that fence beautiful with flowers all around. The Flower Pot Perfect Hook is made to hold most potted plants that have a lip. Make your yard, garden, and patio beautiful with flowers. Normally the Flower Pot Perfect Hook sells for $29.99. But today only on The Daily Gadget, get four hooks and two support arms, all for $14.75. That's only $14.75. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or click on MyCoolGadgets.com. Order now. Problem. Too many bottles, cans, or cups are dropped in the lake or they get warm on the beach before you're ready to refresh. Solution? The Floatinator. With the Floatinator, you no longer have to worry about dropping or having lake water spilled into your drink. Plus, both of your hands stay free. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist. Now you can take your drink into the lake, pool, or ocean and have your hands free at the same time. It's a cup holder with a tether line that you attach to your wrist so it floats with you. Made with a foam float ring for buoyancy, it also has a unique counterweight ballast that protects your drinks from wakes, waves, and cannonballs. Enjoy the water and your drink at the same time with the Floatinator. Buy it now. 
Normally the Floatinator sells for $39.99, but with the special promo code FLOAT, you can buy it for $29.75 for the next seven days. Call 1-888-877-0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. You're out at night and you need some light. You didn't take a big flashlight, so now what are you gonna do? Now that is a problem, but I have the answer. Hi, I'm Make Austin the Solutionist with the Next Torch. It's the small thumb light you can put in your pocket. The Next Torch has a special white LED that is gentle to the eyes and has a reach of over 15 feet. Unlike other small light, this one even has a stand that lets you rotate the light 360 degrees. It also has a magnetic bottom plate, a bungee cord, a carabiner, which offers you countless ways to use your light. On the hood of your car, bungee to a tree limb, or just attach it to your jacket. It truly is the perfect pocket utility lantern. Normally the next torch sells for $39.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget, we have it for $19.75. Go to mycoolgadgets.com or call 1-888-877-0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Order now. Welcome back. You're tuned into the My Cool Inventions Network. I'm Akos, the solutionist, Andrew Jankura, co-hosting today. And we have a pretty interesting product here. It's called No Sweat. They're cap liners <laughs> that go in baseball caps and chef caps. and It prevents the sweat from going down in your eyes. <coughs> and it's kind of cool technology because it's apparently when the water hits this thing, it turns instantly to gel. Yeah. Pretty cool stuff. Now, here's what we're going to do. We're going to get Colin back on here. I mean, we're going to do the pitch. We're going to do the 60-second pitch. We're going to give them 60 hot seconds, and everybody get ready to vote. Thumbs up or thumbs down. All right? That's an important thing. Now, how do you vote? You go to mycoolinventions.com. That's mycoolinventions.com. There's a vote button there. And also, <coughs> if you're on the Facebook feed, you can actually see the vote uh, platform there. We always put a Facebook thing up there, so you can vote right there on the Facebook, uh, the poll. It's right there on uh, facebook.com forward slash mycoolinventions, the mycoolinventions. Facebook. Facebook page. So, with no further ado, Colin, are you ready to give us your best 60 second pitch? Let's do it. The drums are rolling, and Tony just has to pull the trigger. Do you have any ideas? I have a great idea. Pitch it to me. Pitch it, pitch it to me. Hey, I got an idea. Well, let's hear it. Hey guys, uh, Colin Icarella with No Sweat. No Sweat has invented patented sweat lock technology in our performance disposable liners. When you sweat in any hat, helmet, hard hat, visor, that's let that stop letting that sweat interfere with what you're doing or ruining your favorite ball cap. The technology pulls sweat right into the product and converts it instantly to a gel. Simply peel and stick our relief liner and stick it right in your headwear and you're good to go. For as little as four dollars and ninety-nine cents. Yes, four dollars and ninety-nine cents. You can get yourself a three-pack of this product. It's revolutionary. Look online. The pros love it. We have guys in the NHL, MLB, PGA, all across every sport using the product, and soon to be our patented hard hat liner, which is gonna change the way you sweat while you're working. Everyone sweats. Now start stop doing it correctly with no sweat. It's the newest, best technology, no sweat. Check us out, no sweat code. Make or break an inventor. Be our shark and vote. Be bold and submit your product. What the heck? You could only make millions. Good job, Colin. Pretty good pitch. Set up a problem, put on the solution, went for the money, and we cut him off on the website. <laughs> so we're going to give you a chance to give us your website there, Colin. What was the website there? Oh, sorry, yeah, www.nosweatco.com. Nosweatco.com. That's nosweatco.com. And they were four ninety nine for a three-pack? Correct, yep, $4.99 for a three-pack. Oh, we're getting some comments in. Joe Cup just said, great price. Uh, Tony Goldtrap said, I needed this 10 years ago. And, of course, <laughs> I got a big thumbs up from Steve Warple. <clears throat> so, listen. All right. Everybody vote right now. What do you think? What's it? How vote you, Mr. Jenker? Oh, I'm in. Uh, he's nice. going to vote thumbs up. You yeah. guys should vote, too. Go to mycoolinventions.com. Hit the vote button. And is it a thumbs up or a thumbs down? Now, now Andrew, um, I got a couple things going on here. I think, I think first of all, I think he's uh, leaving a 
lot of money on the table, yeah. number one. Yeah. Number two, you played professional ball. Now, Andrew was a professional ball player. Yeah. Uh, he was a pitcher. He was a softball. Let me tell you, he threw that ball about 400 miles an hour. <laughs> Not many gloves were ever manufactured that you could actually stop the ball with. Bionic it, arm. Bionic arm. He kept that. Th- <laughs> we got, that's what we call them bio arm. They kept in there really hot. Uh, and now, if you were playing there, you sweat because we were always playing in the summertime. Always. So you think there's a great market here for this? Absolutely. Absolutely. So, you know, because, you know, you got sweat. I mean, ah, yeah, and you ruin the cap. Well, immediately, every game I have to get a new cap anyway. Because all sweat through and you got all the stains gla- all over the place. Sweat. Ruin it, ruin it. Yeah. yeah, it would ruin it. Yeah. How would it work on your bandana here? I don't know. We'd have to try. <laughs> Gotta get I up underneath. I, people always ask me about Andrew's bandana. He's got actually really long dreadlocks. I don't know if you've ever seen his dreadlocks, but he's got super long dreadlocks. Yeah, uh, he's yeah. a professional musician, so, you know, he's got a bandana on all the time. Now, we've got a couple comments. Uh, Joe Cup thinks it's three for $9.95. Let's talk about that for a second. Um, I, I want you to I want you to talk about pricing because you got three of them for five bucks. That's a great deal. All right. So, do you have inventory in Minnesota? Do you guys carry some stock? Yep, yep. We uh, the pro, uh, product is 100 percent sourced in the USA, and so, we actually do all the manufacturing ourselves here in the Midwest. Always be pitching. You know what I mean? I asked yep. the question: Does he have inventory? I think the answer was yes. Yeah. Okay, but I, there but I learned yes. that it was invented up in the United States, stock of lot. Yeah, I heard all. Assumptive of, yes. Yeah, assumptive yes. Okay, so <laughs> just <laughs> he's a salesman. He's constantly yeah, selling. All right, all right. So the other thing I want to ask you is: If I challenge you for a twenty dollar kit, what would you sell for twenty bucks? Yeah, great question. So uh, our 12-pack goes for $17.99, um, and our 12-pack of our hard hat liner goes for $19.99. All right, so it's, and you're in Minnesota. Where, what part of Minneapolis, or what part of Minnesota are you from? Yeah, uh, I'm from the south suburbs, uh, but we are headquartered out of uh, Minnetonka, Minnesota. All right, so we got a couple questions coming through. Uh, Tony asks, how long does one last? That's a great question. We get that all the time. So it just kind of depends on the sweater. Everyone sweats differently, and you also sweat in different environments. So if you're playing golf, one day it can be 65 and windy, probably not sweating too much. But if you're down there in Florida where you guys are at, uh, 85 and humid, you might go through one a little quicker. So what the product does actually is it starts to bulk up a little bit as that sweat is converted to gel, and you'll be able to tell it gets a little too thick. And that's when it's time to peel it out like a sticker and throw it away. Okay, give me so is it a round of golf? You know, right now in Min- let me give that ask you another way. So yeah. in Minneapolis, the the lakes just melted, right? You just just you finally started to see some water, right? Okay. <laughs> yep. So now it's a little hot, you're playing a round of golf. Well, is it like one round of golf? Is it two rounds of golf? What's the deal here? Yeah, most people up here, all my buddies, uh, they get about five, six rounds of golf. Five, six yeah. rounds of golf. Okay, we understand that. Okay. I think you belong on Inventor Show. I think you belong on Inventor Showdown. We actually filmed that in Minneapolis, Minnesota. I think you need to get uh, with Bonnie right away. Uh, Tony, make sure she gets Bonnie's uh, information. See if we can get him on, get in front of the buyers and get in front of the reality show Inventor Showdown. Yeah. That's in front of 90 million people. 90 million people. Wow. So you have to get a big thumbs up vote. So, Colin, you got to share this video. You got to spread the wealth. Spread the word. Make sure people vote for you because it's the first question we go is, well, how was the thumbs up vote? Amp Wealthy Brown. I wonder if she's wealthy. Amp Brown. Uh, she asks, what colors are available? The only black or the call in other colors? Yep. So we uh, go with black. Um, that's for kind of multiple purposes. Yeah. Um, one, it, you know, it kind of hides in a lot of headwear, yeah. which is unique. You know, people, uh, some people have hyperhidrosis, which is excessive sweating. Um, hyperhidrosis. Little, you know, it, it hits them a little at home. You don't want them to be, uh, you know, to appearance, but also, you know, with the odors and kind of the sweat, like women have a lot of makeup, you don't want it to, you know, discolor, so the black kind of hides that and makes it look fresh. All right, so so that's cool. So it doesn't come in leopard. That's what Ample's looking for. Does it come in <laughs> leopard? No, it doesn't. Only black. Kind of like uh, Ford, yet. actually, said so we carry every color as long as it's black. All right. Okay, so <laughs> we want to get you guys a big thumbs up vote. That's really important. So I want you to spread the word, get all your people in there. And I think this might be a great idea. I mean, the reason I'm thinking, Tony, uh, is uh, for the for the, for the the Inventor's Showdown is coming up in August. It's in the heat of the summer. This might be really timely. Uh, actually, up in Minnesota, too. It's a national broadcast, but you know, hockey players and stuff. We're Canadians, so we understand hockey. We understand all that kind of stuff. Uh, and oh, I'm sorry. Amp Wealthy Brown says he's male. I apologize. <laughs> I don't know why I thought you were female. Amp Brown. I'm sorry. I apologize. He's one of our good followers, too, on there. On there. So, so uh, okay. So, sorry for interrupting, but the product started in hockey, right? Right. Uh, now we're, we have over 25 NHL teams that order the product from us every year. Awesome. Um, and then every yeah. NHL official actually wears the helmet liner in their helmet. Awesome. Um, so 
they ordered just south of 20,000 for the next um, uh, season. And uh, one of the investors and brand ambassadors for the product is TJ Oshie, who just yeah. won the Stanley Cup. So, yes, uh, yes. We don't like those guys. Like hold on, hold on. Stop. We don't like that. the Capitals will beat our Lightning? <laughs> yeah, stop talking. Like <laughs> <laughs> yeah, All right, so big deal. TJ Oshie run. wears it. Okay, so yeah. people, apparently, people who wear it win the Stanley Cup. All right, I got it. Me our guys know. were sweating uh, too much, couldn't <laughs> see in the eyes, let yeah. that goal in. All right, okay, fine. All right. Hey, listen, I want you to call in. Have you, have you signed up for Inventor Master? class tomorrow hit the link hit the link uh, you're a real salesperson it's free i want you to sign up you're going to learn a lot i do an hour of selling secrets and i've got a couple secrets i know you're missing one right now i know your pricing is not quite right in my opinion but but i'm going to show i'm going to show you some secrets i'm going to reveal the biggest secret uh, that inventors need and product developers need to sell their product everybody overlooks it it's my 30 years experience click on the link it's either pinned to the top of our facebook page tony's put it in the comments click on it we only have 200 seats we've got a few seats left register last week sold completely out so go to inventor master class there you have it everybody vote is the no sweat the next hundred million dollar idea maybe you take that last sip of coffee before your meeting and you guessed it it's all over your shirt now what hi i make us the solutionist and you can solve that problem with the s2o stain removing pens the S2O pen is a concentrated stain remover that you can take anywhere. Put it in your purse, pocket, or your car. The effective stain remover can remove any stain from ink, grass, cosmetics, or food off of anything. Just take the pen and rub it on the stain, and the stain is gone. Simple as that. So enjoy that cup of coffee, knowing you have the S2O pen in your pocket. Normally, a three-pack of S2O pen sells for $19.95. But today only on The Daily Gadget, a three-pack of S2O pens are free. You heard me right, free. Click on MyCoolGadgets.com or call us, 1-888-877-0490. Get your three-pack of S2O pens for free right now. Problem, the matches are wet, lighters damp. How are you gonna start a fire? Solution, survival steel. This simple, brilliant device ensures that you can start a fire every time, even in the rain or snow. It's safe, fast, it even could be a lifesaver. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist, and let me tell you about survival steel. It's made from cerium, which is one of the Earth's element, and it can make a spark hot enough to set a fire to almost anything. If you've ever needed to start a fire, survival steel will do the job under any conditions. Look at this. In the rain, dripping wet, or in the middle of a snowbank, survival steel starts a fire each and every time. This 3000 degree spark isn't red hot, it's white hot. Survival steel is a necessary tool for all outdoorsmen. Normally, survival steel sells for $19.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget. Buy one, get one free. Both for $19.99. Call 1-888-877-0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Those hanging baskets you bought are expensive, and you see more of the basket than the flowers. That's not what you wanted. You want flowers and more flowers, not baskets. Hi, I make us the solutionist with the perfect solution, the better basket. The Betta Basket is a unique way you plant your flowers. There are 12 holes around the lower and middle of the basket with the removable panels that make it easy to plant your flowers. When done, your Betta Basket will give you a perfect flower arrangement from the start. As they grow, they will sculpt themselves into something truly amazing. It's also perfect for growing strawberries, tomatoes, and herbs. All you see are flowers, fruits, and herbs. Meta Basket normally sells for $29.99, but today only on The Daily Gadget, you can get it for $19.75. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Okay, you're exercising. You need cardio equipment, strength training equipment, and all kinds of other pieces. That's a lot of stuff, and it can be expensive. If you don't have the space or money, that can be a problem. Hi, I'll make us the solutionist with the solution, the Workout 180. This one piece of equipment incorporates strength, cardio, stability exercises to give you a total workout. It's not only an exercise step and balance board or a push-up bar, it also comes with resistance bands. The seven different levels allow you to reach your results by consistently increasing the band resistance. The Workout 180 is affordable and an effective way to reach your personal goal. 
Normally the Workout 180 sells for $199, but today only on the Daily Gadget, the Workout 180 is $59.75. That's $140 savings for the best workout system you can buy. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or go to MyCoolGadgets.com. Order now. Your car is as hot as heck, and that stupid folding thing keeps falling down, not protecting the inside of your car at all. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist, and that can be a problem. The solution? The Keep Cool Sunshade. With this sunshade, you simply attach it to the windshield with suction cups on the passenger side, pull it across the windshield, and hook it on the other cup on the driver's side. Done. Easy, quick, and no mess from that flicking cardboard folding thing. The answer to keeping your car cool the easy way is their self-retracting Keep Cool Sunshade. Normally one Keep Cool Sunshade sells for $19.95, but today on the Daily Gadget, half price, $9.75. Not only that, the next 50 customers will buy one, get one free, still only $9.75. To boot, free shipping. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or go to MyCoolGadgets.com. Order now. Welcome back to My Cool Invention Network. I'm Akos the Solutionist, Andrew Jankera co-hosting and we just had a great pitch from one of our inventors and you guys are out there voting go to mycoolinventions.com to vote for that uh, inventor now we're going to de- this is the part of the show we talk about selling secrets things that things that get the ball moving things that yep. get the inventor going things entrepreneurism uh, secrets that people need to know and all the pitfalls they're going to run into maybe you're a product owner maybe you're a product developer maybe you're an inventor maybe you got your own store out there pitfalls that happen uh, in the course of the business that you don't learn in school because I don't know. I mean, we've done a lot of you know. We've learned, we went to school ourselves, and and let me tell you something. We we find things that they teach us that don't really apply in the real world. Mm. And then you get to the real world and you learn stuff that, hey, nobody taught me this. And this is where you crash. So this is the part of the segment we always talk about that will help you uh, get away from those pitfalls. Now, today's topic, I want to talk about how do you pick a manufacturer, all right? Mm, How do you pick a manufacturer for your product? Now, we have a lot of experience in this. For example, if you go to evine.com, there's about 80 different products that we sell to them. In fact, if you go to evine.com and just type the word ACOS, A-K-O-S, my first name, all my products show up. And you'll notice there, there's things like chemicals and cleaning and laundry soap, and and then there's metal and plastics and kitchen gadgets all across the scope. And let me tell you something, uh, we have tons of manufacturers that we rely on. And let me say to this, and we, this is where the topic always comes up. So some are Chinese, some are American. Why do we use American manufacturers sometimes? Why do we use Chinese manufacturers sometimes? Let me just cover that for a second, all right? This is a big debate, especially with the current administration, who's putting, we're having now a trade war with China. All kinds of tariffs are being slapped uh, on each other, and now we're warring it out, and I don't know, nothing good comes of it. I just read this morning that over these tariffs, uh, Harley Davidson, who's now been, uh, oh, yeah. you know, not, now been tariffed in China, all they're doing is they just move the manufacturing for the Chinese exports out of America. They're now making them somewhere else. They're going to make them in Europe. And they're going to say, well, to heck with America. If that's what they're going to do to us, we'll make that stuff. And now uh, Europeans are getting jobs that should have been Americans because of these th- Chinese tariffs. So, so you know, when do you, and we're, we're scared too, because because what's going to happen if they start tariffing plastics or they start tariffing things that we buy? Oh. So, you know, these are all things you should consider the current uh, political environment uh, uh, also when it comes to choosing between a Chinese manufacturer and American manufacturer. Yeah. Uh, trade wars never work. Trade wars always, always hurt us because all that happens is the free market just adjusts to it. And you always have to ask yourself the question, how will it adjust? I mean, will it will, will, will lower jobs or increase jobs or lower taxes, increase taxes? These are all questions. And if you're an inventor, you got to ask yourself the question, will I get hurt if I put all my eggs in that basket over there and something changes? Now, we choose Chinese manufacturing when there's a lot of labor involved, okay? Because raw materials, if it's plastic or metal or steel, they're the same in America and in China. There's no difference. It's an open market, free market. They're commodities, right? What difference is is the labor rate because over there is a really inexpensive labor rate. Right. So now today with all this automation and manufacturing, you know, not a lot of 
things get touched by human hands. I mean, less and less and less and less, giving the tipping the scales in the America favor on certain things. All right. For example, chemicals. All right. So so we make uh, cleaning products, and we use a company. We use a couple companies. We have one in Chicago. We have one in Niagara Falls. We have one in uh, Long Island. And and what we do is different people have different skill sets, but we we ba- package chemicals here in America. Right. Why? Is the labor cheaper? No. Uh, but these factories are pretty automated. Not a lot of human hands actually touch the bottle. All right. Yeah. Uh, is the liquid cheaper? No. All right. However, liquid is heavy. You know, yeah, it's going to weigh too. Yeah. So remember, remember, we did this in school. How much does a 16 ounce bottle weigh? Oh, you got me in that on uh, Imperial. Okay, uh, half a liter. Six, half a liter is going to be uh, about a pound. About a pound. Okay. Yeah. So, okay, so there's a pound of liquid in one bottle. So, for example, on one skid of those bottles. Now, you've been working in the warehouse. You've had been thrown around a few skids. Now, yeah. There's 1,440 bottles on a skid. <laughs> That's 1,440 pounds. That That's not nothing to ship. So suddenly, if you're shipping 40 of these skids, all right, now you've got maybe a shipping issue. So yeah. in China. We would spend, you know, we, we've been talking about how much it costs to move a container recently. Right. You've got four and six thousand dollars being quoted, right, for That's your right, container. Forty foot container. Yeah, forty foot container. So if you can add six thousand dollars to, you know, how many bottles, you know, twenty thousand bottles. Okay, now we're paying thirty, forty cents a bottle just mm-hmm. to get it here. Okay. Yeah. So then you look at the American side and say, okay, how much does it cost to make here? It might cost twenty five cents more a bottle to make here. But if the if if the shipping rate is forty cents more coming here, well, America wins, all right. Yeah. And so we find that in the packaging companies, I think America is still pretty strong when it comes to packaging companies. That's why your wet wipes, that's why your uh, Clorox wipes, that's why a lot of bottling stuff. Um, usually, people don't buy that from China; they buy it domestically because uh, because of the shipping rate and because not a lot of well, that's a factory you see a lot of humans touching, but a lot of factories aren't like that; they're all automated. You yeah. should see though. You should see the uh, uh, the laundry sheet factory. And my gosh, they, those guys! In fact, I was here. The guy was calling me, the owner of the company. Um, I mean, they start a run of laundry sheets. It's like a machine it goes. Yeah. It's like newspapers flying past you, and you know, and nobody touches it. I don't. I think he's got one guy operating the machine, and I think another guy holds a box and then pulls another box. But I mean, I mean, it's insane. It's only a couple of people working well, there. It's all done by machines. Right? Yeah, well, I was I was in the beverage business for. A oh while. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. How yeah, that the beverage work? business is the same kind of thing. You're, you're bottling it. You got to make sure. Now are you going to put it in glass or are you going to put it in plastic? Right. All this stuff becomes weight, and then you're going to be shipping a lot of weight going around. So right. that's that's. That's the key. You got to be careful on what, where you're making, manufacturing stuff. All right. So, so that's kind of the difference between where where you manufacture. Labor rate and shipping costs are kind of. And get always. I tell fat inventors get three quotes. Always, always, always get three different quotes. And when it comes to manufacturing things that can be manufactured anywhere, always have two or three manufacturers at your fingertips because you know sometimes one manufacturer can't do it. The other one they get a little bit more expensive. You can actually keep them honest with the pricing. Okay, that's tip number one. Here's the downfall. And I'm going to tell you, and it hurts me, bites me in the in, in the butt every single week. Minimum order quantities and lead times. Let me tell you something. Lead times from China have absolutely, can I use the word sucked on air? Sucked. Absolutely sucked. I've had situations where in January, I get an order for 20,000 units from Evine. Okay? January 1st. So I call up my lady up there, my aide, my person who works for me, okay, we need 20,000 of these units, and we need these things, and okay, we need them. And then she says to me, well, we won't take the order right now. I go, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> well, Chinese New Year's coming up. Chinese New Year? What? what? How long is that? Well, isn't it two weeks? No, no, no. Uh, you see, they're going to take two weeks off before the Chinese New Year. They're going to take two weeks month. after the Chinese New yeah, Year. A month, it's right? a month. Yep. And we kind of shut down for a month, and we're not going to start anything, so there's two weeks lost. So now i got six weeks before they even start the thing. And then it takes them 45 days to make the thing. Then it takes 30 more days to ship the thing. Oh, my goodness gracious. I had a situation there where I was getting an order placed in January and not receiving them till May. Mm. That's a five-month turnaround. Yeah. Let me tell you something. Hot business could live on a five-month selling window. No one. So you have to really dig deep and really research lead times. 
And you have to not just assume that because when you ask them, they say, okay, no, no, there's 30 days to manufacture, 30 days to ship. You're going, okay, 60 days. All right, lead time, 60 days. Because don't forget, when you're dealing with China and America, you also have to take the lead time into consideration, right? Yeah, so it's, it's not just how much it weighs or how much it costs to ship. You're also losing 30 days in your selling cycle. Right. All right. So sometimes we choose manu American manufacturers because they're quicker. And quicker, maybe it's worth 10 more cents, 15 more cents a bottle to make it quicker, right? Mm -hmm. So maybe it's worth that. So you got to take in the quickness, minim, uh, manufacturing lead time. Everybody overlooks that. And let me tell you something. You got to really dig deep and research hard for that because, you know, a salesman, who, by the way, it's a salesman, right, who's talking to you about the lead times. They, they, they don't want to say they disguise it, but they always give you the best case scenario. You got to dig a lead, ask a few more questions and ask about not the best case scenario. Let's get a history and you want to talk to their clients who are maybe I always say to them okay give me a give me a customer you deal with already I want to talk to them because I want to get their experience on lead times right that's a very important question when it comes to how do I choose a manufacturer yeah. you want one as your partner because basically they make money when you make money and you want to see the respect in that you want to see that they're, they're always striving to make it work for you and they, they have to be transparent are they transparent or are they hiding the fact that you know three other bigger customers are in front of you our machines are kind of tied up your lead time is going to take too long those are important second thing i wanted to give you a little insight on manufacturing is minimum order quantities now you were in the beverage business yeah. what, what were your moqs oh you're talking uh at least in the th tens of thousands of bottles. Tens of thousands of bottles. Yeah. So, you know, an inventor who walks up to you and says, hey, hey, I got this invention. I want your, uh, it's a liquid. It's a great thing. It's a protein drink. Oh, my goodness gracious. Yeah. And all of a sudden, they go, they want to buy 500 units. <laughs> <laughs> You'd have to laugh at them. Oh, yeah, okay. You walk up to this guy who's selling over there. He goes, oh, I'm sorry. That's 10,000 units. We're them. not even turning the machine on oh, unless no. we run it for 10,000 yeah. units. So minimum order quantities are very important because a lot of times the manufacturers will charge you a premium right. to short run the product. And by the way, when it comes to liquids, I always learned it's not the, you know, you're, you're not paying for the liquid in the bottle. You're paying for the machine, right? Yeah. And so if they got to fire up the machine, clean out the, think about it, they got to clean out the machine, run your stuff and clean it out again. That's the cost. It's not how much liquid goes through the machine, right? Yeah, it's not bottle, how much bottles nothing, go whipping by, nothing. how much labels get slapped in the bottle. Those are incidental costs, actually. Right. It's always the bottling cost that costs money, not what's in the bottle, all right? And that's why, uh, and it all comes down to lead time, and it all comes down to minimum order quantity. Sometimes you can get a deal from them if you let's let the minimum order, the lead time be a little longer. Let them do it when it's comfortable for them. Let them do it in their downtime. So those are questions you need to ask. How can I get my cost by going to your downtime? Maybe I don't need the selling cycle so fast. And what's my minimum order quantity? So the takeaways today, MOQs, lead time, labor rates, shipping costs, and how that all affects your pricing. That's how you pick a good manufacturer. We have a lot of experience doing it. We have like 50, 60 of these guys going on all the time, and we've been doing it for 30 years. So if you have any questions, I want you to email me at ACOS, A-K-O-S, at mycoolinventions.com. There's a couple selling secrets for you today. A little good knowledge that you don't learn in school, you only learn on the street. Problem. You're jogging and dehydrated from lack of water. That small water bottle attached to your waist is empty and hot and uncomfortable. Solution? The Hydro Water Bottles. These ergonomically designed bottles encourage proper form and posture while running and walking. They provide upper body exercise and hydration. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist and let me tell you these Hydro Water Bottles are fantastic. You get two 16 ounce insulated bottles with easy to hold handles making them easy to carry. The two pounds of water weight will exercise both arms while jogging. You can even add more weight. Run better, exercise better, feel better with the Hydro Water Bottles. Buy it now. Normally the Hydro Water Bottles sell for $49.99, but with the special promo code H2O, you can buy them for $39.75 for the next seven days. Call 1-888-877-0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Charging devices in the great outdoors in extreme conditions is always a dilemma. How do you charge your phone, tablet, or maybe that light? It can be a real problem. Not anymore. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist with the Extreme Tactical Power Bank. 
This power bank is portable, rugged power source, uniquely constructed with an integrated 18,000 milliamp battery. It's waterproof, shockproof, and dustproof, perfect for your next invasion. It has two USB outboard ports to charge two devices simultaneously. It even has a short circuit protection. The four LED indicators show battery life and status. The Extreme Tactical Power Bank also has a 30 meter torchlight, perfect for spotting your enemies. This power bank lets everyone enjoy the outdoors without worry. Normally the Extreme Power Bank sells for $99, but today only on the Daily Gadget, 59 bucks. Call 1-888-877-0490, go to mycoolgadgets.com. Problem, there's one or two times in the day you want to feel clean, but that isn't always the case. Solution, Bob's Butt Wipes. Their all-natural paraben-free formula ensures that you will be fresh and clean. Without exposure to harsh chemicals, it features a unique hanging dispenser that installs in seconds on your toilet paper holder. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist, and let me tell you, you can trust Bob's Butt Wipes that keep you clean. These wipes are biodegradable and dispense in under three minutes so your sewer system will remain clog free. You can easily put them into a specially designed dispenser or take them with you on trips. They come in a variety of designer containers for the children or the outdoorsmen. Check out Bob's Butt Wipes for yourself. Wipes that work as hard as you do. Normally, the Bob's Butt Wipes sell for $19.75, but today only on the Daily Gadget, buy one, get one free. Call 1-888-877-0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Problem, it's raining and cold and you need to start a fire, but everything's wet. Solution, survival wood. This one piece of wood can save your life. Just chip some pieces from the stick and ignite it. It'll even burn when soaking wet. Then it burns hot, just add some more survival wood. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist, and that's exactly how you save your life, by starting a fire to keep you warm or signaling for help. Survival wood is made from the Guatemalan pine, rich in resin. It's a light wood that can be cut easily with the grain. Just a few chips will start a fire for you in any condition, in the rain or in the snow. But if you're in bad weather, a match or lighter may not work. Check out survival steel that can ignite the survival wood under all conditions. In the great outdoors, always have survival wood with you. Normally, three pounds of survival wood sells for $19.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget, $9.75. Just call 1-888-877-0490 or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Here's the problem. It's summertime and you're thirsty and you have guests over. Some people want wine. Some people want beer. Some people want a margarita. Some people want a fancy drink. What are you going to do? Do you have a tool for that? Introducing the solution, the Barbarian. It's a Swiss Army knife for every single drink out there. Maybe you can open a beer. You can open wine. You can crush things. You can make a margarita. You can make a mojito. You can zest. You can clean. You can cut everything that you need in the palm of your hand. It's called the Barbarian, baby. Normally sells for $79.99. Today Today's what a gadget 2475 the best doggone tool for the summer you've ever seen call the barbarian for 2475 go to mycoolgadgets.com that's mycoolgadgets.com you can slice you can dice you can open you can crush you can do anything every single drink that you can imagine this is a, this is a bartender's dream it's called the barbarian normally 79.99 today only 2475 mycoolgadgets.com that's mycoolgadgets dot com <laughs> well what do you think andrew what did you think of the barbarian it's very cool isn't it's that kind of cool now evening. you've actually worked in some of the five star six star restaurants in the world playing music yeah uh, the bartenders have always got all the, they got like a whole uh, a gaggle yeah, a of tricks of right they don't yeah. you know gaggle of things that they use to make the drinks yeah. this inventor he put every single thing into one shot here i don't know if you notice this but you can open that up here right yep. you can crush your you know you can crush your something maybe lime juice in there, lime, citrus yeah. in there give it Great a little fruits. crush by the way that's a shot glass there you can measure it's a 
measuring oh, yeah, device. Cool. You can do a single or a double. So you've got the shot glass. You've got the crushing device on the side there. A jig there. and a jigger. A jig and a jigger. That's right. Take a look at this on the side. You have the zester. You have the peeler. Yeah, you yeah. have everything on there for yeah, you. You can do a little, zest, yeah, yeah. Lump, do a little mar maybe do a little martini. Yeah. Having a little, 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 with a, with a little twist. You know what yeah. I mean? Um, you can do a little opener. twist piece there. Bottle open. Everything's here. You got the wine cork opener. You got the, you got the, uh, what do you call that little knife they use to get the foil off. You can foil on there. You got a regular knife in there. Yeah, okay. This is the, this is a fantastic, fantastic tool. My goodness gracious. I mean, I got to tell you something. One of the best bar, uh, if you have a, you have a picnic outside, you got people coming over for a barbecue, you're entertaining. There's, if you have a bar at home, if you don't have this in the drawer, I don't even know what to say to you because this is everything <laughs> that you need ready to go. Now, it normally sells for $79.99 and worth every penny. It's heavy, right? Yep. I mean, you could hammer in a nail with this thing. Seriously. Yeah. I can break nuts with this thing. I can do whatever I want. Imagine a mojito, right? Yeah, of course. Yeah, you have mojito. You got to yep. do a little pound in there. You got to do a little measure in there. In there. Yep. A little lime going on, lime juice going on in there. Mojito's great. Or, I mean, I love, as you know, my favorite drink is a martini. Yeah. Sometimes I have it with a twist. Sometimes I have it uh, a little bit dirty. And this is a perfect tool for that. It's $79.99 called the Barbarian. We have it for $24.75 at mycoolgadgets.com. Wow. That's mycoolgadgets.com. You know you can even do a guacamole in this thing, right? You can, oh, it's yeah. a tool for guacamole. Everything's in here. On there, What's that one they're using now, the mule thing? They all have copper glasses. What is that? i got to ask Tony because the kids are drinking this right oh, now. What yeah. is that? The What is that, Tony? It's a Moscow mule. Moscow mule. Moscow you lost mule. me at Moscow, you know, so I don't do anything. It's Moscow in it. But, but what's a, what is a Moscow mule, Tony? It is vodka, ginger beer, and a uh, squeeze of lime. Well, maybe I'll uh, change my rule because well, that go. sounds delicious. Yeah. <laughs> they're not bad. They're, they're pretty good. Why do they put them in the copper pots there, the copper mugs or whatever? Is that just a gig or thing or what? Um, I believe when the guy first created the Moscow mule, that's what he had to serve them in. So it just it was just one <laughs> of the things stuck. that stuck. It was just it was made oh. in a copper mug, I it's, think. I know we looked it up before because my girlfriend loves them, and right. I don't remember exactly. All right, so the guy's going, hey, I made a drink. Uh, bring over that pink can. That's all we have to spray. What's that pink can? It's copper? Okay, throw that in here. But with the okay, from now on, good. it's all we serve it. It's good, right? So isn't that great? Well, this, which, which, don't you want one of these? I mean, I mean, think about yeah. this. What's your favorite drink? What, do you, what, do you, what would you do with this thing? Oh, I think, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm squeezing some limes and lemons and oranges and citrus and stuff like that, usually with vodka, you know. Yeah. That's the... You know, we like a vodka drink yeah, and yeah. a whiskey drink. And, you know, that's... Oh, look at that. I, I mean, this is a great thing for you. This is Barb... Actually, I had the inventor on. Uh, he came on live national television with me. He was a G... The guy was a surfer dude. I mean, I mean, yeah. he, he lived his whole life in the California waves there on the beach. And, and I, I actually don't think he has shoot. I think he just came in sandals. He, had, he was a really easygoing guy. And uh, he said he's going to invent the best bar tool ever invented and he did I, th I know he did uh, he paid a small fortune for this because this is really quality stuff I mean th there's metal in here this is solid as a rock it's heavy I, yeah. when I say you can hammer in a nail with this thing you can hammer in a nail yeah. with this thing and I he must have been one by somebody somebody like the juice stuff because he's got a juicer built into it yeah. right and you guys said a jig and a jigger what's the difference between a jig and a jigger well jig I think I can't remember which one's one shot one's the other one's just double. hold on we should, we should ask jigger, our resident jigger drinking jigger expert one, hang on. Jig, let's go to producer Tony Don't Tony what is a jig and a jigger what's the difference I think Andrew's got it correct there. Uh, one's one shot, one's two. Oh, jigging a jigger because Andrew spent his whole life in you know big fancy I'm playing restaurants. In the bars. I don't know. I'm yeah. not that I'm drinking there all the no, time. He's it's playing in the, bars, playing the bars. You know, he so he's got a lot of bar you know play in history. You playing the Live Rock ho Hotel, you know, not the, the Hard Rock, Rock Hotel, yeah, Hard Rock. and all kinds of great places. Oh my gosh, you guys, you see the guy play? It's insane. All right, and you got of course wine, and of course when you're getting a wine, let me let me tell you something about wine. People don't realize. You see this part over here. This this part's really important. This part right over here because you know. How it's two step. You see how this is the bottle opener part, but you know something. When you're opening a uh, opening a, a bottle of wine, you should open the cork one step, two step, and that's actually designed for the one step, two step. People don't realize that's what it's for, and that's exactly what you use it for. And also, when you're doing wine, because I'm a big wine drinker on there, you have to have a defoiler, so you have to have a cutter, right? It's not a cigar cutter; it's a cutter. You notice the cutter here has a different shape to it. You notice how the shape? I'm going to put it down here so you can see it. You see the shape has a little arc to it, and it's got a little little uh, sort of upward arc to it. Yep. That's so it hugs the neck of the bottle, okay? So when you're cutting the foil off it, it hugs the neck of the bottle. Let me see what else he's got up here. He's always got a blade. That's kind of my kind of port. There and he also have another another bottle open there, you see? So you've got the Scale bottle opener. opener on there. You've got a blade. 
on there, and you've got a knife, okay? Because you're cutting limes, you're cutting lemons, you got to have enough. And even this knife is not a regular knife. You notice how that isn't a, a regular blade? That's actually a blade designed specifically to cut lemons and limes. Steve Warpo just gave me a three uh, laughing uh, laughs out there, emojis on there. But I know, Steve, you want one of these, don't you? you I know you do, because this is the best doggone bar tool you've ever saw. <laughs> from our inventor right here, from the barbarian inventor himself, normally sells for $79.99, but today I'm going to give you a drop, $24.75, $24.75. Wow. Go to mycoolgadgets.com, and here's the double drop for you. Just to see if you're watching, you know I, I, I preach this all the time. Free shipping handling. That's right. We'll pay to get it out to you. Free shipping and handling. Everybody share this video. Share it with friends. What a great tool. You're going over to a party. You want to bring something over. Don't bring a plant over to my house. Bring a bar tool. Yeah. <laughs> That's always a right. great you know, Housewarming is perfect. And I got plenty of bottles of wine. Bring me a bar tool because I can use this forever on there. The wine kind of goes away after five minutes on there. So, you know, bring me a bar tool. Great. If you're going to a barbecue, going to a party, this is a great idea. I get a couple of them. They're normally 80 bucks. That is a professional bar tool. That is no uh, domestic use. I mean, this is something that you would have to be uh, maybe in a professional bar services, but we're making it available to the general public for $24.75. Wow. One of our great American inventors came up with this. Uh, he's a surfer dude from California. $24.75. MyCoolGadgets.com MyCoolGadgets.com Andrew Jankira. Any yep. last words on the Barbarian? Can't wait to use it. <laughs> I can't wait to use it. <laughs> oh, my gosh. On the weekends, do we cook up a storm? Seriously, dude. There's steaks going on, barbecue going on, our favorite refreshments going on. We're in the pool. We're on the beach. You know what I mean? On there, we're going to love this, too. I got to get one for myself. Why don't I got to? Where's mine? Did you take mine? Somebody no. took mine. Well, get two of them because somebody might take yours when you get at home. $79.99, $24.75, free shipping and handling. MyCoolGadgets.com on What a Gadget, our daily wag. Remember, wag more, bark less. Problem. It's an emergency. You're stuck in the car with no power. The windows are up, the doors are locked, and it's 95 degrees. What do you do? Solution, the tactical pen. Anybody can break the window without hurting themselves. Grip the tactical pen and tap the window and it'll break. No need to hit the glass with your fist or elbow. And also it has many other functions. Hi, I'm Akos. The Solution is here to tell you that the tactical pen is the Superman of pens. The tip is made of tungsten steel and it's designed to break any window with one tap. It also serves as a deterrent against your assailant. And here's the best part, it's a perfect pen. You can even write upside down with its Fisher Space cartridge. Break out, protect yourself, even write a note with the tactical pen. The tactical pen sells for $59.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget, $29.75. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or go to mycoolgadgets.com. Stains are out. Stop the screaming with Stains Are Out. Oh my gosh, this is the greatest stuff ever. Thank you so much, Banana Man. Who was that Banana Man? Saving the world one stain at a time. Learn the secrets of bananas in my Stains Are Out at StainsAreOut.com. Ouch, that hurt. You just cut yourself again prepping those veggies. <laughs> That's not good. Hi, I'm Akos the Solutionist to tell you the solution to that problem, the knife glider. The knife glider shields your hands from the blade while you're chopping, peeling, or slicing any type of food, hot or cold. Chopping has never been so easy and safe. Now the vegetable and fruit salads can be perfection every time by keeping your food in place without using your fingers as the guide. No more need to hold cucumbers, potatoes, or other food with your hands while peeling. The meat attachment allows you to cut all meats into perfect slices. The knife glider and the attachments fold up into one small unit. Save time, pain, and <laughs> bandages by using the knife glider. Normally the knife glider sells for $19.99, but today only on the Daily Gadget, the knife glider is only $9.75. Click on MyCoolGadgets.com or call 1-888-877-0490. Go to MyCoolGadgets.com. Up. Stains are out. Stop the yelling with Stains Are Out. From zero to hero, thank you. Who 
loves that Banana Man. Saving the world one stain at a time. Banana Man knows the secret in my Stains Are Out. You can too at StainsAreOut.com. You have beautiful potted flowers, and they're all on the patio ground where you really can't see them. And you have that fence that is plain and empty. Hi, I make us the solutionist with the perfect solution, the flower pot perfect hook. These hooks were created to bring your potted plants up off the ground to eye level where they're in plain view. And they'll make that fence beautiful with flowers all around. The flower pot perfect hook is made to hold most potted plants that have a lip. Make your yard, garden and patio beautiful with flowers. Normally the flower pot perfect hook sells for $29.99. But today only on The Daily Gadget, get four hooks and two support arms, all for $14.75. That's only $14.75. Call 1-888-877-0490. That's 1-888-877-0490. Or click on mycoolgadgets.com. Order now.